which means that if there were evidence on the existence of other gods besides Allah, then go ahead and worship them. But there isn't. The Quran is teaching its reader to always look for the evidence and go with it wherever it takes him. Islam is confident that there is no proof on other gods. Islam challenges people to prove other gods. In Surah Az-Zukhruf, which is Surah number 43, Ayah number 81, go to page 333. Go to page 333. Please mark this page in Surah Al-Kaf and go to page 333. 333. Allah tells Prophet Muhammad before his dialogue with the Christians of Najran, قُلْ إِنْ كَانَ لِلْرَّحْمَنِ وَلَدٌ فَأَنَا أَوَّلُ الْعَابِدِينَ Say, if the All-Merciful had a child, I would be the first of his worshippers. Islam challenges false religions. The Prophet of Islam himself tells Christians publicly, I will leave Islam and become Christian if you can prove the divinity of Jesus, son of Mary. If God really has a child, I will be the first of his worshippers. Can you be as objective as we are? If you discover that you are in the wrong direction, will you have the courage to go back to the beginning of the road and start?